Hello dear students, this is the second uh, practical of software testing. Uh, in this practical you need to design test cases for an inventory management system based on the system specification. Okay, uh, so what is the practical significance in inventory management system? Uh, one of the most consumed system for business in day to day life. There is a majority of computerized system needs to be developed to assist uh, such systems this leads to rigorous testing of such modules since business models are based on these systems one need to understand the basic structure and specification of this uh, this type of system before one can test any application which supports inventory management system they need to understand and study the specifications this practically will make a uh, learner to get the acquainted and major specification of inventory management system and design test cases for the same. So we are going to uh, see the actual uh, inventory management system for this practical. I am going to use the Khata book application. Uh, so we'll uh, see what uh, what you need to do uh, or what uh, the prerequisite uh, to perform the uh, testing on that application. So we'll see afterwards. So. Uh, uh, these are the basic relevant outcomes so we have already seen what kind of basic relevant outcomes uh, in last uh, practicals it is all uh, throughout the your practical session this kind of relevant pro program outcome you need to uh, know so first one is a basic knowledge so apply knowledge of basic mathematics science and basic engineering to solve and broad uh, uh, based computer engineering problems next one is a discipline knowledge apply computer engineering disciplines uh, specific knowledge to solve core computer engineering related problems next is experiments and practices plan to perform the experiments and practices to use the result to solve the broad based computer engineering pro uh, problems uh, next one is the engineering tools uh, to apply the relevant computer technologies and tools with an understanding of the limitations okay uh, and the last one is lifelong learning engage in independent and lifelong learning activities in the context of technological changes in the computer engineering field and allied industry so i have already uh, explained uh, this uh, outcomes in last uh, uh, practical also uh, so next is a competency and practical skills so what your uh, what skills builds uh, in you after performing this practical are so you are going to able to apply types levels and methods of software testing on application okay so what kind of different activities you are going to uh, you are able to do so first is identifying the system and its specification and get us uh, get familiar with the system okay uh, use the different uh, software testing concepts the next one is the ability to write system specification of the system uh, fourth one is the ability to design test cases for a given system uh, the next uh, the relevant course outcome uh, uh, you are going to apply the various software testing methods okay and what is the practical outcome you are identifying the system specification and designing test cases for a inventory management system so we are going to see what is uh, what is actually inventory management system we are going to see okay uh, so next is a relevant effective domain uh, related outcomes so uh, what is going to uh, what are the relevant effective domains are you are able to uh, follow the ethical practices okay so you are able to uh, participate in uh, team problem solving activities and you are able to prioritize the time effectively to meet the needs of the team and self okay uh, so these uh, are the uh, domains you are going to be this uh, this kind of domains uh, you are uh, are improved after performing the uh, after performing this practical okay so we'll proceed further